Hi all, welcome to Table Training. We are into Module 4. Uh, in this session, we are going to discuss about Mask Card. Mask Card is a tool which is very helpful in, you know, uh, uh, doing the presentation uh, of the charts. Uh, we, we might use uh, current size, text, details, tool tip. See, all these components are uh, available in one place. That is nothing but Mask Card. So, this Mask Card can be hidden right and also once we have hidden uh, we can enable it again by hitting the mask option from this uh, LOB. If you click on it again you can put it back. So if you don't want we can hide it and again we can put it back. So mask card is mainly you know uh, to uh, present the uh, visualization in a meaningful and uh, uh, presentable manner by uh, by designing the color, size, text, uh, tool tip, uh, 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 components available in this card, we can use it. And similarly, we do by default, the option will be enabled as automatic and we can choose the graph then and there by uh, selecting the option. Let's say like suppose we created bar, bar chart, we don't want bar chart, we, have, we, have, we want to change to uh, we would like to change to line chart. We can do it by clicking in one one click, right? It will automatically change. Let me show you how it is. Let me create first one simple bar chart by double clicking the sales and it will go to the row cell automatically and category. So this is the simple bar chart. So we can either drag the category to the column cell or we can double click by automatically it will go to the uh, respective so if you, do, if you don't want this way, we can always tap the columns, columns to row, rows to columns. So this is what I was talking about. By in the mask card, it's automatically selected because we selected one uh, measure and one dimension, right? It automatically selected the bar chart. So if you want to uh, change this bar chart to line chart, we can do that by clicking the one go, right? So let me put it as bar chart and then. I would like to uh, show you how the coloring uh, component will work in mask card. So for this the coloring component, as soon as I click the coloring component, I can you can see the all the coloring combinations available, right? So if you want more colors, we can choose from here. Okay, yeah. So now we have the bar chart or the category for this category sales. So for furniture, we do have the sales of and then offer uh, office supplies and then technology. So all these cat three categories we have, right? So by using the subcategory or region, let me check, check the region, uh, region, pull the region, drag the region and drop into the color. So we can see the each region, uh, what is the sale. Right, so for in central, see blue blue color indicates central. So yellow color indicates orange color indicates east. Red color indicates south, west. So see, like this, the components can be used. The coloring components can be used. So we can any any time we can change the coloring combination. Right. So if you don't want this way, we can change the coloring to something else. You can assign palette. You can apply. Right. It changes. So as per requirement, we can keep on changing the colors. We do have plain, a lot of variety of you know, uh, options in this already predefined uh, template. This way, with the mask card, we can use the coloring option. Thanks for watching this video.